As you fly toward the drop zone with the parachute you pack, you reach one inescapable conclusion. If it doesn't open, you'll fail the course in more ways than one. Well, this is where you find out. You experience a real sense of achievement when you complete your jump with a parachute you packed yourself. It is a feeling that can be shared only by those who have succeeded at something few other men have attempted. Here in the maintenance shed, you will be given instruction in maintaining and repairing the parachutes you have learned to pack. Keeping a chute in good condition is also vital to a jumper's safety. First, you get a thorough course in operating sewing machines. So thorough that you want to apply for a pass, so you can go home and tell your mother what she's been doing wrong. Once the general art of operating sewing machines has been mastered, you learn how to use light-duty machines to patch or replace sections in a canopy. Another conventional machine, the heavy duty, is used to repair harnesses and other webbing. You are also taught how to operate such specialized sewing machines as a zigzag machine, used to sew the suspension lines to the canopy. A hook eye attaching machine for attaching hooks to parachute pack trays. A bar tacking machine for reinforcing the ripcord pocket. and a darning machine, used to darn a small hole in a canopy. Sometimes a darning machine may not be available, so you're taught how to do the job by hand. Other hand repairs taught include replacing grommets and inspecting and assembling harness quick release assemblies. Again and again, it is emphasized that no matter what type of repair you make, you must always inspect the parachute thoroughly. A special shadow box table is provided for inspection of the canopy. This table with its lights underneath allows you to spot any defect in the fabric. All defects must be noted on an inspection tag. An identical inspection is made after the defects have been repaired. This final inspection will also serve as a double check to ensure that when the paratrooper jumps, his parachute will be in perfect condition. 